Mr. Hagan, has this session of the General Assembly been a session of special legislation, special interest legislation? I, I think you could say that it has. I, the, certainly the lobbyists and the special interest group have worked a lot harder this time than they ever have before. A lot of the members of the General Assembly put a lot of bills in at the beginning of the session for the interest of people on the street, but very few of them ever seem to survive when they get in committee or come out on the floor. What are your feelings on that? Well, I think the fact that the special interest group uh, see that they're killed, they, they uh, twist arms and get them killed in committee and elsewhere, and they, they have some good arguments to them. Uh, there's no one really representing all the people other than the delegates, and, and these lobbyists can certain and special interests can be uh, right forceful sometimes. How effective are the lobbyists? I think this session they've been very effective. Could you show me an example? Well, I think the fact that uh, here we are two weeks from adjournment and the tobacco tax basically has been killed by the tobacco lobby. I think that the uh, fact that uh, you still have your gasoline tax uh, uh, alive and the possibilities of passing it with most every delegate and, and senator saying they weren't for it, uh, it's still alive and there's a good chance it's going to be uh, pushed through by the uh, Road Builders Association. I think that... Uh, the retail merchants, what they've done to the blue laws, uh, what have you, is a good example. Not that all these are bad, good or bad, but the fact that uh, the lobbyists have uh, just about had their way.